This is video number 88 on your firearms defense channel. This is a continuation from video 87 and uh, I hope the new improved YouTube is going to download 87 because it ran just a little over 15 so I'll see if it don't I'll have to redo it. But anyway, as a continuation this next quote I have here is a very interesting one and the quote is God forbid we should ever be 20 years without such a rebellion. The people cannot be all and always well informed. The part which is wrong will be discounted in proportion to the importance of the facts they misconceive. If they remain quite under such misconceptions, it is lethargy, the forerunner of death to the public liberty. And what country can preserve its liberties if its rulers are not warned from time to time that this people preserve the spirit of resistance? Let them take arms. The remedy is to set them right as to the facts, pardon and pacify them. What signify a few lives lost in a century or two? The tree of liberty must be refreshed, refreshed from time to time with the blood of patriots and tyrants. It is its natural manure. Well, naturally, like everybody else, when I first read that quote, I only read the last sentence, which of course is out of context. So, so I thought it was a quote from some white supremacist or maybe a Black Panther or somebody like that, you know, because that seemed like a pretty radical quote to me. But then I, uh, I read the author of the quote, and it was none other than uh, Thomas Jefferson, uh, one of our founding fathers and a great intellectual and the third president of our country. So uh, it was then that I put this in its proper perspective, and I just, uh, I just love that quote. I think it's a great quote, and uh, you know, so. So anyway, to uh, sum up, I'm going to sum up this video here. This is going to be a relatively short one compared to the last one. I'm going to sum it all up here. Perhaps Mayor Calvo's family pets, Ayanna Jones, the John White, and Officer Jeremy Henwood did not die in vain. Perhaps their lives and their blood were given in some symbolic fashion as nourishment for the tree of liberty. And perhaps in some distant millennium, perhaps millions of years from now, perhaps we will all live in peace and brotherhood and we will not kill each other. And uh, perhaps my uh, firearms defense channel will uh, be just uh, passing antiquity uh, preserved in some uh, museum or some, uh, some historical artifact as a sign of the times that we live in now. And the needless tragedies that unfold on a daily basis before us. This is your Firearms Defense Channel signing off on video number 88 and I will see you again on video number 89.